Forecasters at the Slidell Office of the National Weather Service were gathering a variety of reports of damage on Saturday, April 14, the result of severe weather rolling through southeastern Louisiana and southern Mississippi. Below are reports from posts to the Weather Service's internal chat room by emergency managers, forecasters, ham radio operators and television meteorologists. Some also have been reported to the service's National Storm Prediction Center. Asterisk and emergency manager and WAFB-TV meteorologist Jig Rimes reported damage in parking lots near the Industriplex area of Baton Rouge, possibly caused by a tornado, at 8.13 a.m. A National Weather Service forecaster said it's likely that officials won't be able to conduct a survey to determine if the damage actually resulted from a tornado touchdown until Sunday. Asterisk the Long Beach Miss Fire Chief reports damage from a water spout at the harbor, with two boats capsized, and debris around the area. The information was reported to the National Weather Service at 2.51 p.m. Asterisk Fire and Rescue officials reported several trees down in the Palm Lake area of Slidell on West Hall Avenue and Front Street at 11.15 a.m., the result of thunderstorm winds. A firefighter reported that some of the trees on Front Street landed on power lines, and that several transformers had blown. Asterisk A Tangipahoa Parish Emergency Manager reported more than 100 trees were felled around Arcola, and minor shingle damage involving area buildings. The cause was listed as thunderstorm wind damage at 8.40 a.m. Asterisk A Firefighter reported that 2.25 inches of rain had fallen near Fremo Town Center in Slidell through 12.38 p.m. Asterisk An East Feliciana Parish Emergency Manager reported a dozen trees were downed in Clinton, and a few rural roads were blocked, the result of thunderstorm wind damage at 7.40 a.m. Asterisk A Firefighter reported three inches of rain had fallen in the Palm Lake neighborhood in Slidell as of 12.56 p.m. Asterisk Fire Rescue officials in Baton Rouge reported a tree fallen on a home near O'Neill Road and Antioch Road, the result of thunderstorm wind damage, at 8.05 a.m. Asterisk Pike County, Miss, emergency management official reported a few trees down on the south side of the Macomb at 8.25 a.m., the result of thunderstorm wind damage.